Today I am making Cool Whip candy. This recipe popped up on my Instagram feed and it is supposed to taste just like a Three Musketeers bar. When I found out it only had three ingredients, I knew I had to give it a try. So let's make some candy. You're going to need one eight ounce tub of Cool Whip that has been thawed, six cups of milk chocolate chips, that's about three bags, and one and a half tablespoons of vegetable shortening. Place three and a half cups of milk chocolate chips into a microwave safe bowl. You're going to microwave these at 30 second intervals, stirring between each one until the chocolate is melted and smooth. Set aside the remaining two and a half cups. Once the chocolate is all melted, add eight ounces of Cool Whip. You can use an electric hand mixer to combine these. I didn't find that necessary. I just used a spatula to fold them together. Once the chocolate and Cool Whip are well combined, pour this mixture into an eight inch cake pan that has been lined with parchment paper. Make sure that you have a little bit of overhang when you put the paper in the pan because that's gonna help you lift out the candy a lot more easily. Smooth the top with your spatula and then place this in the freezer for at least 30 minutes. The recipe says 30 minutes. I'm gonna say that you should let that sit for a little bit longer because it was very soft when I moved on to the next step which is cutting the candy into bars. So go ahead and take that out of the freezer. Pat yourself on the back for remembering to have an overhang of parchment paper because look at how easily that came out of the pan. And then cut your candy into whatever size and shape of bars you would like. Yes, I did break out my ruler for this. The recipe suggests cutting this into 16 squares and then cutting the squares in half to make 32 bars. I don't think I made it to that. Just do what you can. You're supposed to break these apart and then put them back in the freezer. They were just way too soft for me to do this, so I just stuck them right back into the pan and then I put them back in the freezer for another couple of hours this time. Once they've firmed up in the freezer for a little while, it's time to dip your bars. Place the remaining chocolate chips into a microwave safe bowl along with one and a half tablespoons of vegetable shortening. Microwave at 30 second intervals, stirring in between each one until the chocolate is melted and smooth. Use a fork to dip your bars into the melted chocolate, tap off the excess, and then place them on a sheet of wax paper. Place your dipped bars in the freezer again for another couple of hours and then they're ready to enjoy. These will keep in the refrigerator in a sealed container for up to five days and in the freezer in a sealed container for up to 30 days. I'm happy to report that these actually do taste a lot like a Three Musketeers bar. If you'd like to try them for yourself, the recipe link is in the description down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel by clicking on the red button below. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!